Internet Marketing, a few quick featured frequent questions. Today, we'll tackle a few frequently asked questions regarding SEO and websites. Let's get right to it. Ready? Question number one, how important is it to follow Google's SEO guidelines? It depends on how you look at it. Many fly-by-night black hat SEO providers ignore the guidelines completely and somehow manage to gain decent rankings, only to find that these results don't last and they get penalized a short while later for trying to game the system. For lasting long-term SEO rankings, it is vital to follow Google's SEO guidelines faithfully after all, they pretty much spell out exactly what they want to see in a well-optimized website, so why not provide them with what they're seeking? Question number two. I've heard it's important to optimize every web page individually, is this true? In a nutshell, the answer is yes. The truth of the matter is that most search engines look at each individual web page almost as if it is its own unique standalone website. One way to find success is to ensure each page would indeed be able to hold its own if it were the only page of the site that existed. By treating each page with due respect this way, when all put together to form a comprehensive website, they all help build and strengthen each other. Question number three, even with the prevalence of social media lately, is blogging still recommended? Again, yes. Despite what you may be hearing out there in the social media world, blogging is absolutely still alive and well. The bottom line is that maintaining an active blog as part of your overall web presence is an ideal way to keep fresh content rolling along and extending your site's range within the search engines. Each new blog post is essentially a new search engine listing. The compound effect can be quite remarkable. Question number four. Is my five-year-old website still okay? Possibly, but unfortunately most five-year web technology is pretty deficient when compared to what's available today. Depending on the circumstances, it's probably time for a complete new website design, or at least a solid revamping to integrate modern SEO, social media, and other important staples of the web for 2010. The good news is that it doesn't necessarily have to cost a fortune and moving forward with high-performance SEM, search engine marketing, should more than pay for itself when it comes to the return on investment.